Hi guys, I'm back with another vlog. So today, it is a very rainy day, like it is literally pouring. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna get out of bed, cause like whenever it's raining, I never wanna get out of bed. I just wanna like lay inside, like, this, like without sunshine, it just makes me tired. But I was like, I'm gonna get up, do my makeup, curl my hair and live my day so i'm gonna go grocery shopping very soon and then i will give you guys a grocery haul so i got two packages on my doorstep and in the last vlog you guys really liked me doing the unboxing so let's do that again today honestly okay this one is the other one i don't know what it is i was gonna say that <laughs> Sometimes it doesn't say what it is on the box and I'm like, shoot, what did I order? This one is from Kim Kardashian's website. This one girl I follow on TikTok um, was wearing her lip liner and lipstick and it looked so pretty. So I ordered it and also just a couple more to get free shipping. So I got two of the nude lip liners and then two of the nude lipsticks. I'm really excited to try her stuff out because I don't have that many different lipsticks and all that. I kind of just wear like the same ones or just like a lip gloss. This one's actually just a rose oil. But this one is Classic Icon 1. I'm not gonna try it on right now, but this is what it looks like. They showed Courtney wearing it as like the model and it looked so pretty. And then this one I got is Nude 2.5. This one looks like this. Ooh, this one looks really pretty. And honestly, I really liked the Kylie line. I thought her lipsticks worked really good and still use them till this day. And I got them like four years ago and they still work. So I liked her stuff. And when I go to Sephora, there's so many different brands. I never really know what brand to get. And then I got the lip liner Nude One. Looks like that color. And then I got nude too so i probably will be wearing these very soon maybe i'll put some on later and try them out this one's just a little bit darker and then this next package i'm thinking it's apple oh yeah it is so i ordered these when they first came out and it took like a month to come but i'm so excited because i always lose my stuff <laughs> but like honestly just misplaced not really lose lose but you basically put one of these circles in like your purse your wallet and you can track it on your phone and my brother got them too and he said they work so good he got them before me and like it literally tells you the direction and exactly where the item is and that could also make like a noise so if like it's in your house you could set off like the alarm so i put little emojis on mine so i could tell the difference between all four <laughs> Honestly, like an emoji will make a difference. I don't know. It's like free to customize it. So I was like, why not? Here they are. Look at my emoji. So this one is an S for Steph, obviously. The next one, <laughs> cute. It's a little kissy face. And then we have a heart and a peace sign pretty cute oh they're so cute and small it's basically like an m m like don't mistake this for an m m and swallow it one time they had like those giant m m's they had like fudge in the middle or it was like something different i don't even know if they have them anymore but i put one in my mouth it was about this size and i started going down the steps and i just swallowed it whole and it like really hurt but yeah don't swallow what if you swallowed your air tag could someone track you whoa that would be a cool experiment does anyone want to try that out <laughs> okay i just got back from giant eagle and i'm gonna give you guys a little grocery haul okay so i'm going to be making a cheese board very soon for my friend's birthday so i got ritz crackers saltines peppers carrots celery sticks and then i got this veggie dip ranch so we could dip this stuff in there and then i got some already cut up pepper jack sharp cheddar I got this buffalo wing hot sauce cheese. I'm so excited for this. This is going to be good. And then I got this southwestern flare cheese. I don't know. I thought it looked good, so I want to cut it up in little cubes. And then I just got some pitted olives as well. And then I saw these sauces. I was like, ooh. So spicy secret sauce, a creamy sriracha sauce, and this says try with eggs, burritos, and more. Sriracha is my favorite, so I'm really excited. And then this one is jalapeno ranch. And this says try out salads, pizza, and more. And what I'm going to be making soon also, um, it says it calls for spicy ranch. So I'm going to use maybe this one for the taco ring. I'm not sure yet. I'm going to try these. But I saw this TikTok 
showing how to make this taco ring. It's basically like a cheesy gordita crunch, but in like a big ring. It looks so good. So I got some hard shells, some Taco Bell seasoning mix, some Taco Bell cheese, also some Taco Bell like nacho cheese, and then some crescents. But then you just kind of put it all in and make a roll and bake it. Mm, looks really good. I'll have to put it on my Instagram story or TikTok whenever I make it. Then I got a pack of Baby Bell cheese. I've never had the Gouda flavor, so I'm super excited to try that. And then I got this two good two grams of sugar yogurt, just vanilla flavor. And then I got these two shots. This one's vitamin C with probiotics and all that in there. And then this one is electrolytes. So I wanted to try those ones out. I've not had those flavors yet. Actually, I think I did have this flavor in the last vlog. Then I just got some raspberries and grapes also for the cheese board. I got some kiwis and I got some lettuce and then some thinly cut chicken and then also some ground beef for the deli ring or taco ring. <laughs> so that is my little haul. I'm gonna put the stuff away. Hey Crispy, what would you like to eat for breakfast? Ooh yeah, that sounds good, me too. With raspberries and blueberries? We'll have to see if the blueberries are bad, but let's make a yogurt parfait. Okay, let's try out that yogurt that I bought at the store, and let's see if it's good. Also some raspberries, and then also I'm using this really good granola and these coconut chips that I love. So in this drawer here, this is where I keep like my fun, cute bowls, <laughs> Like these, and these, all the bowls I use for like my yogurt parfaits and oatmeal bowls. Today, I think I'm just gonna use this little guy. I hope I like it. Sometimes the ones with like barely any sugar are really gross. Okay, that's not bad. Compared to these other ones in my fridge, that's actually good, I like that. So that has two grams of sugar and this kind has no sugar, and I was just like at the store, and I'm like, ooh, look how healthy. Like, let's get this one. It's so bad. Um, I, like, had to keep adding more granola and fruit to it to, like, try and hide the taste. But this still has, like, that bitter taste. Obviously, it's Greek yogurt, but with the two grams of sugar, it's still good. So, yay, I'm happy. And then I'm going to do some granola on one side. And then I'm gonna put my berries on the other side. I love like making these and making them look so pretty. I don't know why, it's just fun. And lastly, some of these coconut chips. And these are both from Trader Joe's. I have not been to Trader Joe's in a while. I need to go there. I'm gonna put these just down the middle. And voila, we are done. Look how good that looks. I'm about to film a video, so I want to try out one of these new lipsticks. Which one should I use? I'm thinking the lighter colored one. I'm going to be wearing like a brown shirt. So I think if I have brown lips on, it's a little too dark. Okay, let's try this lighter shade. Wow, this is really pretty. It actually went on so smoothly too. Okay, that's really pretty. Okay, and then the dark shade or the lighter shade? I think let's try the lighter. Does it look good? Whoa, I feel like a Kardashian now. Ooh, it's pretty. I like the dark outside with the lighter inside. Kind of blend it all together. Oh, I love it. Okay. Just did a ton of editing. Also, look at this card my mom gave me. How cute. Because I was really upset about my ceiling falling apart, which I was getting lots of questions asking for an update. And it still looks the same. <laughs> But just had a buffalo chicken salad with some grilled chicken from grilled chicken I made the other day. Um, and now I am going to go to Sephora because I need foundation. I've been using this e.l.f. foundation for like the past month because I've been out of my foundation I usually use. And I definitely notice like I get more oily and it kind of looks more cakey towards the end of the day. Which I mean it was only a few dollars so I don't see like... It lasting all day anyways, but I'm just gonna use some of this elf translucent powder 
and blot my face because it looks oily. And then also, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get the same foundation as last time, except this one's a little orangey, so I'm gonna see if they have one like basically the same shade, but more like a cool tone. If not, I'll just get the same one. Hi guys, I'm in this new Airy offline store, and they have like athletic-y stuff and just like cute like hiking gear. And like, look how cute this stuff looks. Like cozy shirt. And these are leggings. I actually really like this print. And then these are biker shorts. And then they have like these TikTok ones that were popular. I've never seen them before though. They were always sold out at my mall, but let me try them on. Uh, I don't know. These are super short, like really short and see-through. I think the sports bra is cute, but it's see-through. <laughs> I love the color though, I don't know. Okay, these kind of look like a giraffe. Is this me? I think these might be too busy, and I don't like how the band is not the same color. But I love this top. It's like a slouchy, cozy top, and they had it in all different colors. Love this color. Well, I am back from the mall, and I was supposed to just go to uh, Sephora and Zara, but I actually did a return at Victoria's Secret Go Me. I returned one bathing suit. It was a zebra print top with just black bottoms. I was like, and like, it's so expensive for Victoria's Secret. So I returned that, and I got like 70 bucks back. And then I did get just this cute bralette that was in pink because they were like connected at this mall. Thought this was really cute, and then it had matching underwear, just like that. And then I also just got this bra because I really like the color of the leopard. Because I have leopard print ones, but I feel like they don't look like this. So I thought this was really cute. Oh, and the little snap in the front is a V. Oh, that's so cute. And then I just got a little roll-on perfume. This is in Heavenly. And I keep smelling the coconut. I put on like a coconut perfume on a Victoria's Secret. But I was like, mm, I'm not going to get my perfume for Victoria's Secret. I'm going to go to Bath and Body for like lotion, perfume, and body wash. So I went there. And I hope I like this stuff as much because that one smells good. But I didn't get it. So there was a deal buy three, get two free. So I got Belize Tropical Lotion. Why does this smell like feet? It's not my feet. Okay, that low key smells like feet, but I think once I put it on and stuff, it won't. When you smell it out of the bottle, it smells a little different. Then I got coconut, just full on coconut. I wanted to get some coconut stuff for summer because it makes me happy. Then I got the Belize body wash. Okay, yeah, that smells good. I don't know why I got a smell of foot. And then I also got that one in the body mist and then just straight coconut in the body wash. And then from Sephora, I asked the worker if they had that foundation in like maybe one shade lighter because I felt like when I went in the sun, like it didn't ever match my neck and it looked orange. So she gave me a different shade. It's just one shade lower and she tried it on my face and it matched really well with my e.l.f. foundation. So this is 3C3. And then I got this little palette, it's by Sephora. It's just so cute and little, like perfect for traveling or something. And uh, I don't know, I just had to get it. It's so cute. I think those colors are gorgeous, like perfect for summer. Cause I always do like the same browns and tans basically. And then this is the shampoo and conditioner I use, Moroccan oil. I just got two miniature sizes for when I go on vacation because these are perfect. And honestly, you use like all of this in about a week. They go through so quickly. I bought one for my last vacation and I was in the checkout line and I saw them and I was like, okay, I'll get more because I go on vacation in June. And then, can you guys tell my ends are lighter? Now that I'm like in the sunlight. Oh yeah, look at them. Wow, they really have faded. I actually kind of like it. It looks almost like ombre. Cute. I was just talking about wanting to dye my hair. Okay, and then at this offline airy store, I ended up getting this sports bra, which I never tried this one on, so I hope I like it because I got it in this 
brown color. The back is cool. And I also got it in this like light purple color. It's like mauve or something. And then I got this cute little t-shirt the worker was wearing it. I was like, oh, I like that. It says coffee. So I thought this would be great to just wear like if I do a Starbucks video sometime soon, if Starbucks comes out with a new video, if Starbucks comes out with a new drink or a Dunkin', of course I will be wearing this, but I thought it was cute. So then I got that one shirt I liked in a, like, it's not black, but it's just like a dark brown almost. So I got it in that color, and then that one color I really liked, love this color. And then I just went with that green sports bra. And yeah, that store was really cute. I like it. So I got some sports bras now. Now I need to start working out. Now that it's summer. So that was my haul. Okay, now I really need some dinner. And I'm trying to think like what to eat. Because today was like my good day. Like a healthy day. So I had yogurt this morning. And a salad with grilled chicken. Um, and like honestly, I can't even think of what else to eat that would be like healthy. Because I'm not eating another salad. I don't want more grilled chicken. So I got these... Noodles stuffed with cheese. So you can literally just microwave them and it says add your sauce to the bottom of the dish. I'm going to use just marinara. So I'm going to mix some of that with some seasoning. Ragu is my favorite marinara. Oh, so good. So I'm going to do some of this and then some, some garlic because oh, I'm, I love garlic so much. So we're just going to do a little bit. Just a bit of garlic powder as well in here. We're making this like microwavable frozen dish into a gourmet dish. And I think I'm also gonna put some mozzarella. So it said put some at the bottom of the bowl. I feel like this will splash all over my microwave now. <laughs> I hope not. I was gonna add mozzarella on top, but it already has cheese on the inside. We'll add a little bit. And I'm also going to add a little bit of Italian seasoning because we are bougie. And there we go. Let's microwave it. Thank goodness for this microwave cover or else there'd be sauce splattered everywhere. How does it look? Ooh, looks like Olive Garden. Sheesh. Oh, someone smacked me now. Added some red pepper flakes. I'm kind of cutting it up so I can eat it soon because it's so hot. I'm cutting it up in like little bite-sized pieces, but mm, look how good. Ooh, look at that. I mean, really, you cannot go wrong with cheese and marinara and a noodle. It's always good. You know how Taco Bell, like, everything on the menu is like the same ingredients, basically, but in a different form? It all tastes very similar, but it's all very good. That's like pasta. It all can taste very similar, and it's all so good. <laughs> well, I finished my food. That was really good. Um, this vlog is basically like in the kitchen, unboxing packages and new stuff I bought. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you'd like to see more, please click the thumbs up and subscribe. Also, click my notification bell so you guys always get notified when I post a new video. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.